Hello guys and welcome to my preview of the Antutu benchmark on HTC Desire Eye. Uh, now I'll be just talking about the frame rate and the Antutu overall benchmark score. So let's begin with the Antutu benchmark application. Regarding design, aesthetics and everything, I once again invite you to check my review on Gadget Compare. I have to say that I used this device for two weeks now and uh, it never twitched, it never crashed, uh, the operating system, the application, everything. And I really loved playing real racing on this beautiful display. The frame rate was very fluid. Uh, so no matter what uh, and to do benchmark score where will I get uh, on this device, I have to say that it works very nice, uh, very fluid and it's enjoyable and fast. It has the same uh, Snapdragon 801 chipset like the uh, HTC One M8 and 2 gigabytes of RAM and the display is 5.2 inches with uh, high pixel density with Full HD 1080p resolution. Okay, so let's see how many frames per second will we get. And as expected, this is uh, 20, uh, average 20 or 25, maybe 30 frames per second on this resolution. That's what I expected it to be. It's, it looks very fluid uh, and it's really enjoyable to play games on this device. Now it uh, came up to 40 frames per second, so it can be even better. Oh, uh, I guess I guess it just crashed in the end, and this is the first time that uh, some application on this device crashed. It says it's not verified score. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to test it again. Okay, so this is my uh, new and to do benchmark score. Uh, I'll be looking just for the frame rate. As I said, it's uh, 20 frames per second, but it can go up to 40, 45 frames per second. And uh, I find it uh, very pleasurable and enjoyable to play advanced games like Real Racing Tree on this device. I think it will go up to 40, right? 45 maybe. Okay, so I guess this is the maximum, 40 frames per second. Oh, it got 47 and that was the maximum. Let's see the overall score. So it got 39,000. Now I know some devices that got 33,000 33, on my Antedu benchmark and they weren't that good and that fluid uh, for usage. So this is a bit better uh, result, but it's nothing spectacular. As you can see, S5 Galaxy One, uh, HTC One M8 has uh, better results. Okay, well, I'll just show you the device info. So it's quad core, ARM processor, uh, 30 megapixel camera, two gigabytes of RAM. Okay, 30 bit cores. High pixel density. Temperature is uh, 37 degrees, and uh, I can tell you that I feel it uh, a bit heated up right here. And uh, when I hold it, it's uh, I, I can say that 
it heats up pretty much so uh, so you I have to cool it down or uh, when I'll play games I'll have to hold it like this uh, to not feel uh, the heating on the back uh, a lot of uh, sensors are uh, supported and uh, that's it for me uh, thanks for watching uh, I invite you to check my other and to do benchmark uh, tests and for all the reviews uh, go to Gadget Compare YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.